Good day, learners. This is Mentor Ray, Ray Gapus. Your mentor, our Amtrak's R and Test Preparations Coach, and I've been doing this for more than 25 years, okay? More than half of my lifetime, okay? So at this point in time, I'd like to once again remind you that, you know, just like the lesson that we learned from this pandemic, go back to the basics. So if you are preparing for the NCLEX, even if you've studied high polluting concepts related to disease conditions and disease conditions which you only guys know, okay? Don't understand why someone they're preparing for the NCLEX would want to know something that they are the ones who only knows about it, okay? So if you're the one who only know about a certain concept, chances are it's not going to come out in the test because even those who are creating the test questions would not know about it, okay? So it's as simple as that. So let me share with you now our NCLEX are endpointers related to the SATRAC method. Okay? So before we begin, I'd like to invite you to join me or us, my group, in this mission. Our goal is to provide free NCLEX are in application and review to 100 nurses. And because we want to do this, because we want to change the lives of at least 100 nurses this year, to help us achieve this, just watch and finish the ads in our videos. That's the only thing I'm asking of you in exchange for the videos that we are creating. So thank you so much in advance for doing so. So reminder, if you have questions, kindly send me those questions through um, this email mentor at raygapus at gmail.com. So let's begin with my favorite method of studying. Something I created took me three years <laughs> to perfect this method, okay, and a master's degree in the U.S. University. Okay, so the Zaytrak method is used to administer medications intramuscularly. Usually, these medications are those which could potentially um, stain the skin, okay, like iron dextran, okay? So in adults, the ventrogluteal site is preferred for Zaytrak method of drug administration, and the vasus lateralis can also be used as an alternative. Okay, so in Zaytrak method of drug administration, the site is not massaged after the injection. Now, if you're going to ask me, so what are the things that one should know when, when one is preparing for the NCLEX related to the SATRAC method? The most important thing, so you can demonstrate the competence expected of a nurse who would be able to provide safe quality care to the patient. The most important thing that you have to remember would be, you have to show mastery of the steps, okay? So, to do that, let's try answering a sample question. And the sample question is actually what we term as the drug and drug type. So the nurse is about to use the Zaytrak method of drug administration to a client. Arrange the steps in order by dragging the steps in column A and dropping them in proper sequence in column B. Once again, you have the, this, um, the steps that are not presented in sequence in column A and you're being asked to drag each of these steps in a proper sequence in column B. So if you're going to master the steps of the SATRAC method of drug administration, what's the first thing that you have to remember? Of course, you have to prepare the things that you need. And after that, okay, you have to prepare the site of administration, okay, by cleaning it up properly. And after that, the first step would be to pull the skin laterally with one hand and inject at 90 degree angle with the other hand. Why do you have to pull the skin laterally? Okay, it would create the zigzag, okay, direction underneath the skin and eventually the skin serves, okay, to actually lock out the puncture site, thereby, okay, preventing staining of the skin. After that, the next step would be to aspirate for five to 10 seconds, okay? If no blood occurs in the syringe, slowly push the plunger once again, okay? When you actually aspirate for blood, you'll have to wait. It's not as if you aspirated for one to two seconds and that's it. So aspirate for five to 10 seconds. If no blood occurs in the syringe, slowly push the plunger. And you have to administer the drug slowly. So you need to keep the needle in place for 10 seconds and then apply pressure to the site after, okay? So uh, the most important thing that you have to remember is that you do not massage the site after a SATRAC method of drug administration, okay? So 
Shout out time once again. Congratulations to our online review NCLEX passer from Baliwag University. She's a graduate of Baliwag University. Maria Josefina Pilar de Perlado. And she passed uh, the licensure test for the State Board of New York last October 22 by attending our online review program, which has been in existence for more than 10 years. Uh, thank you for the trust, Josefina, and we wish you well. May you turn your great American dreams to reality and may you be able to achieve all the goals you've set for yourself and your family. Our pleasure to be of service to you, okay? So for those who are aspiring to become USRN, Let's learn together. For more instructional videos, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Gapus Mentors, and my Facebook page, Mentor Ray. So if you have any requests that you may want me to cover a specific concept, make it simple for you for your um, study in, in a specific... Um, okay. So send in your request to my email if you may want me to cover some concepts which you may want me to simplify please do send me a note through my email mentor.raygapus at gmail.com so disclaimer okay this instructional tool is created to enable students to develop their test taking skills the question or question and answer or answers contained in this instructional video were patterned after the official publicly accessed samples from the rn test plan of the national council of state boards of nursing or ncsbn the discussions and rational presented in the video are based on the lecturer's research and are meant to provide an explanation for the answer or answers to the question or questions that is or are presented the lecturer makes no claim directly in implied or otherwise, that the rational discuss is officially endorsed by NCSBN. So if you love this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe um, button and of course the bell notification button. And see you in my next video. Don't forget to finish watching the ads. <laughs>